Aquarius, hello. Okay, so this is a reading for anyone whose birthday is between January the 20th and February 18th. What is the overall energy for Aquarius? What is the overall energy for Aquarius spirit? What is the overall energy for the next two weeks? The Page of Swords in the Page of Wands reverse. All right, so this is cute. Hmm. Announcements, the instability um, behind these announcements. Conspiring with bad intentions. Okay, so either Aquarius are spying on people with bad intentions or doubt behind something. And getting news or people are spying on Aquarius and trying to give them bad news. The obstacle is that Aquarius are focused on the bad more so than the good. So I feel like the change is coming from you, Aquarius. Don't focus on the bad. Aquarius are thinking about heartbreak. You guys are not, you guys are past the perfect contentment with somebody I feel like and things coming in fast or things moving too fast oh my goodness I see you guys are in your bag I see something around you okay okay we're about to break this down because it's about to, about to have an anxiety attack okay so like I said I definitely feel like either Aquarius are spying on somebody with bad intentions or somebody is spying on Aquarius with bad intentions so just like I told who is that Forgot what sign that was. Be careful how much you put on social media. People will use it against you. And they will use it in, in the form of announcements or evil news or instability and indecision. You gotta be careful. Clarify um who is spying on Aquarius. So who's doing the spying? Clarify the page of swords in reverse spirit. Who is doing the spying? somebody that has not moved past the situation just like capricorns y'all got somebody that are either in y'all um in y'all space somebody haven't moved past maybe how y'all you know ended or how y'all stopped communicating something but i feel like this person is spying with a vengeance or this might be you spying on somebody because y'all not over you know how something ended don't be like that that's balance and with it being in reverse, balance is disrupted. A declaration, a confession, publicity, a proposal of love. Oh, so I feel like maybe somebody that Aquarius expressed their love to or somebody is, has recently expressed their love to you, Aquarius. And maybe they're spying on you with bad intentions. They're just waiting on something. But I also feel like... This is a product of Aquarius, your mind. You focusing on the worst. Like, it's five cups total. But y'all only focusing on, you know, the tipped over three. Five is change. This is saying it's change. Change your mindset. Um, Five of cups is a card of loss, but something remains. A card of inheritance. It may be a card of marriage, but not without bitterness and frustration. Wow. I definitely feel like you guys probably have been thinking like, maybe this, maybe you guys are um, caught up in a relationship situation. And I feel like you guys, or we, I feel like um, the overall emotion is that maybe you guys are trying to get past something, but you can't. And I feel like you guys really focus on the bad. And I feel like y'all doing this. I feel like maybe y'all dealing with... We're going to clarify this. Y'all focus on the bad and y'all making it come to life. Because I don't even see why this person is really, you feel me, spying for a bad reaction. The Ten of Wands and the High Priestess. You guys are carrying very heavy loads. Are you guys are trying to do too much and putting too much on y'all selves with new beginnings. I'm hearing be realistic. Pace yourself. Balance, work, and play. 
and high priestess, your intuition. Aquarius, I have the issues with change, new beginnings, and their intuition in regards to communication. Maybe you'd be wanting to say something to somebody and you'd be like, no, nah, I'm not going to say that. But something deep down, be like, no, nah, say it, say it. But you'd be like, no, nah, I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say that. I feel like that's the issue for you guys. And what you guys are thinking about is heartbreak. Maybe you guys have been worried about or constantly thinking about um, situations that hurt you guys. Situations that, you know, left you out in the cold. Felt like you were, you know, something stabbed your heart and you got that nasty polluted rainwater making love, the wounds sting. Like, ah, that hurt. But also the King of Swords in reverse. I feel like this is um, Air Sign, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Maybe you guys are thinking about somebody that was... That was cruel. That had evil intentions. Breach of faith. I feel like you guys are thinking about heartbreak caused by somebody who would never stick to their word. Um, who you felt like had bad intentions from the jump. It's just breaking your heart to think about and realize and put two and two together with all this stuff. And the King of Cups. And the King of Cups represents on... Um, so definitely two people. So maybe you might be heartbroken over two situations. A man of business, law, a creatively intelligent person. It might be the same person. It might be a situation where you guys are heartbroken because of how somebody was in the past. And now they seem to come up as the King of Cups. So they went from the King of Swords in reverse. You know, a super toxic person to the King of Cups. You know, they're creatively intelligent or they seem to have it all together they seem to be flowing i feel like um maybe you guys are feeling torn between has this person changed or not or maybe just due to the fact you guys have two situations going on that you're heartbroken over there might be someone from the past that was super toxic always going back in their word never making sense and somebody who you feel me like they drink tea with their pee up. They, they decent, right? Okay. You're like, what do I choose? Clarify what else Aquarius has been thinking about. The Page of Pentacles in Reverse. Alright, so. The Page of Pentacles in Reverse represents unfavorable news. Luxury. like you guys have been fighting with yourself you know trying to expect the worst probably from something or been thinking about fights or how certain fights change um certain things maybe you're thinking about oh we were good until january 30 you know i'm about to say 37 maybe a day in february um maybe there was a big argument in february with you guys and somebody and you guys have been thinking about how things have changed since then You guys are thinking about all the changes that you guys have probably been going, you know, going through or have went through. The hangman in reverse. The hangman in reverse represents selfishness, the crowd, body politic. I feel like you guys have probably been thinking about how unselfish you are and how selfish someone else is or thinking about the vast majority, like how everyone is moving now. Maybe things that you have not called judgment on. You were thinking about times that, you know, you stayed in situations and didn't call judgment. What's um, beneath you is the Ten of Pentacles. So new beginnings and gains, riches, family matters, the abode of family. I feel like um, maybe you guys are definitely done trying to um, mend situations. It might involve family or it might involve a family life. With somebody, I feel like you guys are both trying to mend that and trying to, you know, think fast. But energy you guys have coming towards you is 
rupture, division, and interruption. Clarify this Knight of uh, Wands. What do Aquarius have coming towards them, Spirit? What do Aquarius have coming towards them? With this Knight of Wands in reverse. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. The Six of Cups. I told y'all, don't let memories, don't let old situations stop what you have going on. I'm such a hypocrite for saying this. Because I, I literally be in my own head too. Like, yeah, whatever. I remember when you had gave my dog some chocolate. Now you want to sit up here and act like you didn't kill my dog. <laughs> Hell, <laughs> can't say that. Okay, but... Yeah, so I feel like definitely memories are what's going to be stopping you guys. Don't let memories put you in a bad energy because you attract bad things. Yeah. Chariot. Making movement, cancer energy to get out of your head. I definitely like you guys are going to be out of your head. Emotionally stable. The Ace of Cups is a, I feel like a romantic blessing. T.W. Hmm. It might involve someone. I'm not going to go there. And the Four of Cups in reverse. I feel like you guys may have put up with a lot of um illusions or may have put up with a lot of, um, a lot of, you know how they say, wolf tickets. I feel like you guys are not doing that no more. I feel like you guys don't have to. The Ace of Cups, this is true hearts, joy, contentment, nourishment, abundance, fertility, felicity. And the four of cups in reverse is new instructions and new relations. Definitely. I feel like you guys, um, like I said, once you get out of your head and know that you have to change your mindset, you guys are moving towards staying out of your head. True hearts, joy, contentment. Like, y'all going to be happy. Like, for this that fertility. You know, it's hard to, you know, have a baby if you're not in the right spiritual, you know, condition. Physical condition. You got to be upright. If you stressed while pregnant, you can lose the baby. So, you definitely, I definitely feel like you guys are, your health will be improving. You'll be feeling physically good, mentally, emotionally good the next two weeks. I feel like y'all going to break past the barrier of not being able to, um, Stop thinking about this. Remember, if you think about it too much, it will bring it to you. Right now, I definitely feel like Aquarius are in their bag with this Queen of Pentacles. Generosity and security. You guys are in the, um, the present moment of, of securing security for yourself. Making sure you guys are secure. Making sure, um, I feel like you guys too are being very generous. The Four of Wands in reverse things are increasing for you guys. You guys are living in abundance. Life purpose. I feel like you guys, um, I'm seeing light bulbs go up for people in their um, life purpose. What they're supposed to be doing in life. What else is going on with Aquarius right now? What else is going on with Aquarius? We're going to leave it like that. Your environment is the five of pentacles. There has been a change around you. Somebody is feeling left out in the cold. Somebody is feeling abandoned. Clarify um, this five of pentacles for Aquarius environment. What's going on in the environment? Oh, a lover. Gemini energy might not be, but a lover is definitely feeling abandoned. Clarify this five of pentacles. Five of, oh, the Emperor in reverse just slid out. So what this look like, y'all? What's this story? You got the Five of Pentacles. Somebody feel abandoned. They feel left out. This is somebody that you had romantic relationships with. But they were not in their power. They are not in their power. They're not ready to stand for it. Um, Emperor in reverse is somebody powerful, commanding. You know, the one that makes decisions. This person is not in their power at all. But this is somebody that you dealt with. And they feeling left out in the cold. But they weren't doing what they were supposed to be doing. And that's how they got left out in the cold. So they just need to get some gloves. The Emperor's in reverse. What? The Emperor and the Empress in reverse. Popped out. I definitely feel like... Maybe they're dealing with somebody... 
I feel like they gonna blame it on that. I feel like somebody around you is probably blaming um an ex or something. Oh, I went towards this person because you abandoned me. I thought you loved me, and I feel like this person um creative ideas, new beginnings, new start. I feel like um what this is is whoever that you rejected, they're starting something with another low vibrational person. The emperor and the empress is here. They're starting something um, with this person, but they're both in, you know, reverse. So I thought they definitely might be saying like, "Oh, you led me to this," or this definitely just might be somebody in your environment. Let me see. The truth coming out about something. The truth might be coming out about um, a recent lover. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, yeah, like I said, for some of you guys, they might be dealing with another low vibrational person. For some of you guys, this person, it could either be a female or it could be a male, but they were not where they were supposed to be at. And I definitely feel like the truth is coming out about this. People are starting to take notice. You know, like, okay, maybe it wasn't this person or, you know, it's crazy because now we're starting to see this person's true colors. I feel like people are really seeing, you know, this person and the truth is coming out. Maybe they might be waking up to the truth too. They might be reevaluating they self. Yeah. Clouded joy, follow decadence. This person is since you left that mountain of cold, this person has been experiencing clouded joy. I feel like nothing really makes them happy. Your hopes and fears is the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Voided ambition, cupidity, extract, extraction, and usury. I feel like you guys are scared to get into a situation where you feel used. You're scared to get into a situation where you feel like you were a fool for love. You're scared to get into a situation where um, that's just not good. A situation where people won't meet you halfway, won't put hard work in. The sun in reverse, you guys are scared um, of getting into a situation where there are tons of secrets or a situation that, a dark situation basically. A situation that was not sent to you from God. Clarify um, the nine of cups in reverse. With all of this, I definitely feel like you guys are scared of getting another bogus relationship. The outcome for you guys is three of pentacles, skilled labor, renowned glory, clarify this three of pentacles. I definitely feel like you guys are about to start working hard. Remember I said y'all currently sowing seeds for security. Y'all need to put that in a book somewhere. Sowing seeds for security. But I feel like y'all sowing seeds for security and people are watching y'all. They like, we see that hard work you putting in. Thank you. But we see y'all. Even your ancestors up there like, we see this. We see the glow up. Remember I said too, somebody is watching y'all. Somebody watching y'all. You can't help, you know, you putting up your biz. You have an online biz. You can't help that. But just try not to put too much of your um, wins on social media. But you also have the Six of Pentacles. This is gifts coming in. That's, you know, that's decent. Presence, gratification. Now is the accepted time. Present prosperity. Y'all are about to be in y'all glow. Congratulations. Death in reverse. I feel like it's going to last for a long time. But y'all also going to be happy. Let me see. Clarify this death in reverse. Y'all about to be in y'all glow. And with this death in reverse, I definitely feel like this energy is going to last a long time for you guys. Wheel of Fortune, it was destined. I feel like the wheels of karma have cleared for you. Destiny, fortune, success, luck, and felicity. I just said y'all will be y'all glow. Y'all have good things coming. Y'all have really good things coming. 
So congratulations. And I feel like this energy is going to last for a long time. So use this time wisely. Use the next two weeks wisely. Manifest. Like, share, sub, what's that? Subscribe, comment. If it resonates for you, let me know. But congratulations, Aquarius. You guys deserve it. I just want to thank the universe. No. <laughs> but yes, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Um, I am available for personal readings. Hit me up. And yes, have a great day.